So to start with, I uh, have the Smart 2.0. We launched the first generation of Smart in 2009. It's been a great success and now we're updating it for 2018. The main change is that we have uh, significantly improved the braking effectiveness of the device. So it uh, brakes a lot faster and it uh, completely blocks the road. So it's a safer device to play with as well as more convenient. Climbing partners, he's taking a lot of rests on the climb. You, you no longer have the whole weight of the climber. On the braking hand, it's since the blade device blocks. We have a, a two component grip with a soft touch and feel to it, better grip. And we also reworked the geometry. So yeah, the whole handling is, is slightly improved. A recommended use from 8.7 to 10.5 millimeters. This is the smarter. It's, a, it's an add-on for the Smart 2.0 and we made it for extra safety in case of misuse. For all belay devices that are based on uh, the tuber principle, uh, the higher up you have your braking hand, the, the less the belay device breaks, right? So in this case, if the climber falls, there's a big chance that he will fall to the ground. And that's why we made the smarter. So it's an add-on, clip it on. What it does, it makes sure that these two ropes, they're not 100% uh, parallel. And when the climber now falls, this little bend here triggers the, the braking mechanism of the Smart 2.0 and the blade device blocks the rope. Extra safety in case of misuse. And it's removable. We made it for primarily for beginners. They use it for a while and then when they don't need it anymore, just take it off. You can hang it up on your harness. It weights only eight grams. So it's just there, you don't notice it when you're belaying, but in case of misuse, then it reacts. Smarter, you can buy it separately, it's 19 euros, or you buy it in a whole package together with a new Smart HMS, Smart 2.0, and then it's at 69 euros. To, to give rope, pull up like this, like this. When you pull in, you do like this. And when you want to lower the climber, do like this. A high performance braking insert, so it's offer that extra friction. That's what it does. And together with that, this opening is a little bit more narrower, and as well as this opening is a little bit more narrower. It's what makes the blocking function work. For sure, compared to the old device, it, it's a harder catch. It blocks the rope, so yeah, you have to work with your body. If you want to belay softly, run with them. If you're extremely light, it's no problem. If you're heavier, you have to think a little bit more and, and work with your body. And develop the smart HMS at the same time. So there, yeah, for the best performance when it comes to handling, you should buy these ones together. But uh, you can use any Mammoth HMS carabiners works as well. Uh, what's special about this one is, yeah, we made the body, it's quite thick up here and it yeah that's really good for for the blocking and it has a really yeah round surface area that's also really good for the for the handling i took one and a half two years and uh, it was obvious to us that we need that we needed to do an update i mean the old one is from 2009 it's been a lot of uh, competition bringing similar devices over the last couple of years so we, need, we knew that, okay, we need to step up when it comes to design, that was obvious. And then the question was like, how do we do it better? That was the hard part. It's, it's such a clean design, you cannot do that much with it. And yeah, but after testing, talking to climbers, our sponsored climbers, reading reviews, we just realized we need to work on the, the blocking function and to add extra safety. And that's what we did.